Welcome to Guy Coco Gamers. I'm Daryl Benson, and uh, this is another bite sized episode that really doesn't have too awful much to do with gaming. But I just wanted to let you guys know that we're kind of having a purge in our dust moment. Um, the big gargantuan computer that you see to the left of me, that is huge, that I built not too long ago, is going away. Um, instead, I have opted to move everything to a Surface Pro 3 environment, which I think will be just fine. I don't really game too much on the PC anymore. I do everything via my consoles, and whether you like that or not, that's just a matter of opinion, but um, it's nothing wrong with the PC per se, it's just that I don't use it. So having something a little bit more mobile, something that's very powerful, and something that's smaller <laughs> is good for me, even if it means that I can't really do Steam. So uh, I'm sure Steam will work on some games on it. It's still nothing to sneeze at. It's a uh, 8 gigs of RAM i5 processor, which is what this thing has. So I'm looking forward to that. But uh, in the course of me kind of changing everything over in the next few days, uh, obviously I will not be able to do any videos. I will try to have Mike kind of continue where I've been leaving off and keep the momentum going, uh, but no promises. Um, so really quick. <laughs> Uh, so that this isn't like a one minute video, I also want to talk about avoiding media when you're trying to keep a surprise. So uh, my wife and I are going tomorrow to the movies and we're going to see the Star Wars trailer uh, when we go see Penguins of Madagascar. And I've been avoiding everything to do with iTunes and the internet and everything in general to not see this trailer beforehand. and. You know, wanting to be on top of everything gaming, I decided to go ahead and go to IGN tonight. And <laughs> right there on the front page, of course, is a screenshot showing off two ships um, that are going to be in the movie that obviously came from the trailer. It, it, not necessarily the biggest surprises or anything, but still, it, it was just so defeating <laughs> that I, I survived the whole day, you know, and... And then I, I saw something early. I, I know it's only a few shots. Um, I will not be checking comments on this video because I don't want anyone spoiling it for me uh, until tomorrow. But uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to Star Wars more than you can possibly imagine. Um, my buddy Mark, uh, he, he does the Rebels Project at Disney and I've heard some things about episode 7 and I'm just really looking forward to it. Nothing like leaked or anything, he's not, not saying anything he shouldn't or anything, it's just, uh, you know, I, I, I know what he's, you know, doing with Rebels and I, I'm really hoping to see that Disney takes the same level of care with their movies and I have full faith that they will. In fact, everything that I've seen from Rebels so far is, uh, um, reassuring that Disney knows what they're doing with this property and for anyone bitching out there by the way uh, just remember that Lucas was completely done and he wasn't going to be doing any other movies ever again so just be happy and shut up if you don't like JJ Abrams and just be happy and watch a movie pretend it's a movie not politics and uh, that's my advice to you and also don't go to IGN when you're trying to Avoid a movie trailer or a teaser trailer. So, uh, hopefully I didn't, you know, say anything that was, like, going to ruin anything for you. But are you trying to avoid the trailer? Are you going to see it in the theater? Um, have you already seen it on the internet but still want to see it in the theater? Because let's be honest, that's a completely different experience. Just let me know in the comments below. And again, this is Daryl Benson with Guy Coco Gamers with another Bite Size episode. And as soon as we're up and running... I shall see you guys later. In the meantime, hopefully Mike Frazier will be doing some videos for you guys too. We have a crap ton of games coming in right now, and I'm sure that we'll be doing reviews for all of them. So keep your eyes open on our channel. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.